Hey guys, been a while since I posted, but good to be back in front of the camera and talking to all of you. So, you may have noticed, like, for a fitness guy, I don't talk a whole lot about food. That's because nutrition is something I'm still learning, still working on. Me and my wife are just trying, just trying to find out what works for us, what doesn't work, you know. Um, but I always like to share little tips or tricks as I learn them and little tools. And that's what I'm going to talk about today. One of the things that we've really been enjoying in order to get more meat into our diet, diet, uh, especially at home, is finally buying a decent grill. So we got that grill uh, a couple months ago and we've been using it like crazy. Uh, but in order to get more vegetables in, you know, a lot of times you're outside, you're working on the grill, uh, cooking that meat, and you don't wanna have to go back and forth, inside, outside, inside, outside. Uh, maybe while you're working on some vegetables. Uh, you could roast them in the oven, that, that works pretty well. Uh, but if you want to like do it all in one outside, I just picked up, and this came highly recommended, a grill basket. So, I've already coated this with some olive oil. This is a Weber grill basket you can see it's got all kinds of little slots in there to let the heat through but then you can throw it onto your grill let it preheat as the grill heats up and uh, throw your vegetables in there so I'm about to uh, make a couple steaks for supper here uh, it's just me and Oliver tonight Deborah is out shopping with a friend so gonna make some steaks here gonna throw some vegetables in I got literally whatever I kind of had in the refrigerator. I've got some red pepper, I've got some portobello mushroom that I'm gonna chop up. I am just gonna uh, grab some asparagus, chop it up into little, little chunks, and then I'm gonna toss all that in some olive oil, maybe some salt, pepper, garlic, and just toss it in there and kind of see what happens. This is literally the first time I'm using this thing. So you're coming along for the ride to find out how easy it is to use or not easy to use, uh, how easy it is to mess up, because if it can be messed up, I'll probably mess it up. So, we'll give this a try, see how it goes. recommendation from the manufacturer is to give the vegetables a toss every couple minutes or at least turn them over five minutes in and they should be done cooking in about 10 minutes so give them a quick toss let them sit for a bit longer see how it goes So that was about 10 minutes on the grill. These look really good. I'm super excited to get into them. Uh, it's really about 10 minutes total for the meal. I'm about to take the steak off too. So super simple, super quick. Only took me a couple minutes to chop up the veggies, season the meat. I think the grill worked really well. Uh, I'll eat it and if I change my opinion, I'll t point it in after this, but if not, just take my silence as acceptance that it worked great. So I'm gonna go eat, put my son to bed. I'll put a link to this uh, particular grill basket down below. There's a bunch of them on Amazon if you search, but this one just came real highly recommended. Lots of really good reviews. So go check it out if you think this is something that will add value to your life, uh, make cooking and meal planning a little bit easier for you. I really think it's gonna be a great addition to uh, our kitchen to our 
utensils and our tools that we can use to cook healthy, nutritious meals and looking forward to get a lot of use out of it. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up and uh, who knows, as I get this nutrition thing figured out, maybe there will be more videos talking about food, ways to prepare it, ways to cook it, all that kind of good stuff. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.